Swindon has a rich working history and today is one of the UK's most steadily growing local economies. Today we're celebrating here at the Brunel Centre with a very special exhibition of photography and art, featuring over a hundred different companies working with people in our area. Whose idea was the tapestry to bring them all together and create this wonderful display we can see here at the Brunel Centre? Both of us. Again, it just it, it seemed you know it was a visual narrative. Uh, you know, the, we, we, we both kind of clicked onto this buyer tapestry idea, the idea of telling a story from left to right. Um, and uh, yes, it developed from there. And as you can see, it got quite big. <laughs> uh, it has been a, a, a big ambition to do something locally. Well, I, I actually feel quite emotional. It's, uh, it's been a year's work. Uh, we've, we've had this day in mind. And it's just so wonderful to see, uh, a, you know, an amazing amount of people that have come from, from all businesses, from BMW, uh, from uh, Red Virtual Office and uh, Tamwood Dance School. It's fantastic. Uh, we love this town. I actually love it. It's a very friendly place. And we thought, OK, well, let's start there. And as we got through this journey, we began to realize, I mean, we, we've interviewed a lot of people uh, who own businesses. And we began to realize after a while, no one is really saying, when we ask them the same questions, you know, how's business? Oh, it's, it's, it's pretty good actually, yeah. pretty good. And uh, you think, oh well, that was a lucky one, and then you get a, and after <laughs> yeah. about 95 of these, you know, business, well, business is business pretty is good. good. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, um, I think in the end we've accidentally kind of recorded and venerated success, even though that wasn't sort of our intention. So Sue, so how does it feel like seeing your picture in print? Well, to be honest, it's a relief that it's so blurry and you can't see all my wrinkles. But no, it, seriously, it feels absolutely great. Um, when Tim came to, this, to us with this idea about um, looking behind the scenes at 100 companies in Swindon and finding out what makes them tick, um, we, were, we were interested. When I saw some examples of his work, I was even more interested. They've done some fantastically creative things with um, print and with um, photographs. And I think we're all intrigued to see what actually happens behind the scenes of companies in Swindon. It's absolutely brilliant. And it really screams out to me what Swindon's all about. It is diverse, it is exciting. It's a town that tends to hide its light under a bushel. But if you actually peel back the layers and look what's going on, there's loads of really good, fun, useful, creative, economically strong stuff happening. It's a really nice opportunity to see the changes in Swindon and all the companies that have changed and actually bring them all together and have an exhibition where people can come and celebrate that. It'd be nice for the shoppers to see something different, bring a bit of vibrancy into the town centre. It really is about the positives of Swindon and showing all the different companies and what Swindon is all about really. So it's nice for us to be able to get involved with the community and show that we're not just about retail for people to come in and shop. We do have different things on in the centre and it's trying to encourage people to come back to the town centre and this type of event really helps. Swindon has a very big heart. Come along and enjoy uh, the tapestry which has 100 companies on it. 200 images, one by myself and one by Tim, representing each company. This really is an amazing piece of artwork, celebrating businesses in Swindon by a local photographer and a local artist as well. Now it's here at the Brunel Centre until the 26th of May, so do get down here and you can even take some of the art away with you. It is available for sale at reasonable prices. And after that, it's been donated to the council. It's a fantastic exhibition, don't miss it.